signifies the expansion of Asian media from the written word into the social media. Now to commemorate this bold new move, Asian Beacon will also launch its brand new logo as you shall witness in a moment. So sit back and embrace Asian Beacon's new and exciting venture. Alright ladies and gentlemen, the new logo to be launched in 7 seconds. Four. Ministry name, distinguished guests. Shall we just take a moment to welcome all of you to the 45th anniversary of the Asian Beacon? Five anniversary together with his team. They worked very, very hard. I'm sure we want to hear a few words from him. So please put your hands together and welcome Mr. Gokun Singh, the chairman of Asian Beacon. Wow, this is just impressive that we have to see so many of you here uh, this evening. Uh, but again, we, we thank you uh, from the bottom of our hearts to just uh, for you to continue support Asian Beacon. Um, again, Pastor Chu, can I? Uh, quote you again, Asian Beacon cannot die, right? It, it, it has to continue uh, to survive, uh, especially in the Malaysian context of uh, what is happening. But today, what you're going to publish, or uh, what the writers, your editors, or your feature writers, your column writers, is going to be distributed throughout the world, regardless of race, creed, creed or religion in any part. Uh, but then, we remember it again when we close our eyes. In times when we don't know, let this be
to the marketplace and proclaim his conversion or to proclaim his vision. But God intentionally sent Paul to the humble home of a humble servant. Asian Beacon has a great legacy and I personally believe it has an even greater future. Now I'm going to be here to invite you unapologetically to help Asian Beacon over the next five years, perhaps even over the next 55 years. 45 from a humble beginnings in 1969 as an in-house black and white publication, more like a newsletter to being a national magazine with a circulation of 15,000. Our journey has been nothing short of amazing. Yes, it's not been easy, but it's in our challenges that we experience God's goodness. He brought brothers and sisters to journey with us through their leadership, ideas, funding, knowledge, and tons of prayer. For having made it this far, we are utterly grateful to everyone. So Father, we pray for the printed word and now even for the digital word, even as the Asian Deacon move forward, Lord, we know it is a vision that is birthed from you. And we pray that even this new vision, these new vision statements that you give to the, to the leadership will carry forth, Father Lord, so that more and more people will be reached to the, to the digital world, Father Lord. Father. And asking, O oh God, that even as your hand has sustained Asian Deacon all these years, you will take it through. And not only take it through, Father, we pray, take it through to higher heights for your honor for your glory. That it will scale our Father, O oh God, heights that is unimaginable because of your hand upon Asian Deacon. Truly, Lord Jesus is the true living God that we serve. I am one of the examples how God is so real in my life that my life was shattered by God. No, and He picked me up. I said, Lord, I can't do it. And I remember the Lord said in 2 Corinthians chapter 9 says, My grace is sufficient for you. 5005 going thrice. So to Dr. Tuadri, please give him a big hand. I'll donate the pen back into Asian Beacon to put it in the office for everyone to admire. Great to reward. God bless you. It means to reach more people. Thank you and praise you. In Jesus' name. Amen. So friends, a new beginning has just been launched. A fresh chapter for the ministry. A vision given by God. Let's do our part, whether every day, big or small, to support Asian people.